mesa to the western skies with the sound of a thousand cattle drive. A chosen few would see the light and fight the wrong with right. Up on the mesa, high above the clouds, there's a world apart from all the rest. On the mesa, live the real cowboys, standing up for law and order, and living by the code. Him again. <laughs> we ain't gonna be in here too dang long, Marshal. <laughs> yeah, we'll be out this as soon as you can save Beaupre from the big bail. Don't count your chickens yet, hombres. You did rob the Mesa stage. But it's Judge Baloney who's doing the sentencing. Well, here he comes now. Well, now, I think these poor rascals have learned their lesson. You may release them, Sheriff. Got you, Mayor. <laughs> Seems a mighty lenient. That's why I'm the judge and you're not. Maybe you ought to try a new profession, Marshal. I need someone to uh, shovel out my stables. Later, Mayor. Much later, Marshal. <laughs> Well, hey there. You got a right sorrowful look on your face, Moo. Well, Miss Lily, it ain't been my day. And I was kind of figuring today would be memorable. What? Anything special going on? Well, now that you ask, it's been... Uh, say, Dakota, this is a, a real good time to fix that saddle of yours. Uh, oh, oh, yep. So long, everybody. Uh, adios. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, you were saying, Moo. Well, nothing much. Just that today is... Oh, sorry, Moo. You know, these glasses need washing up before the dinner crowd arrives. Congratulations, Moo. Ten years on the job today. Problem is, nobody seems to care. Maybe I should hang up my star, Cyclone. I don't think I'm making a difference. Yeah! Sorry, I was just practicing my fishing, and, well... <laughs> Don't pay no mind, Sheriff. At least I know the fish will be safe when you retire. Now eat up. Mm -mm. You're just too good to me, darling. I don't know why some lucky bull hasn't swept you off your hooves years ago. The right bull never asked. Gunfire. Sure, sure, you ain't gonna believe it. Oh, we've got some real outlaws in town. It's bad blast a gun and his gang. Never thought they'd come to Miller Glen. Things could get a little messy here, boys. Yeah, on our lane. Now take your sister home right quick. 
Hold it right there. You're all under arrest. He's all yours, Bat. Let me go! Not till you learn to be friendly to strangers. <clears throat> Start cranking, Gil. <laughs> you boys don't know who you're messing with. Oh, yeah, you ain't no Santa Claus, I know that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you are one soggy T-bone steak. Shame on you. Let the poor bull down right this minute. What do we have here? A heifer with a big mouth? Maybe we ought to shut it for her. <laughs> Shut it up. Do that, and you'll have to answer to us. Utterly. Sid, show them what we think of that. Those are bad news. You don't have to tell me. Frank, Beans, there's only one bull who can help us. Marshal! Marshal Bull! <laughs> oh! ah! Special delivery. Blige, Jack. Dear Moo, please come to Miller Glen. Sheriff T-Bone needs your help urgently. Yours always, Bessie Bluebell. Hmm, Bessie. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Sounds important. Any response? <laughs> Marshal? <laughs> I'm sorry, Colorado. I just never made cornbread this big before. But it'll be worth it to see Moose Face at the surprise party. Now, you didn't let on you knew about his anniversary, did you? No, but maybe we should have. Moose gone to some place called Miller Glen. He didn't even say goodbye. I don't suppose he's upset at us. Miller Glen? Well, well that's Moo's hometown. <laughs> Moo learned everything he knows from the sheriff there. The good bull's name was Sheriff T-Bone. The good sheriff taught the young Moo about riding and all the things that go with being a real good cowboy, like shooting. <laughs> Moo just idolized Sheriff T-Bone. And in return, T-Bone treated Moo just like a son. a special place in his heart for Miller Glen and for the folks there. Howdy. Anybody home? Uh, Marshal Montana? Frank? Beans? I reckon it is. Mind if I ask you what you're all doing under there? Hiding from Bat Blastagun. His gang could ride in here any minute. Come on, Sheriff T-Bone's gonna be happier than a pig in slop to see you. What? Moo? Moo Montana? Guilty as charged. Yeah! It's good, good to see you, son. You oh, I tell you, you are a sight for sore eyes. Yes, you are, too. Well, Moo, I'll tell you. Bat blast a gun and his hoodlums done shot the place up. And I couldn't do a darn thing to stop him. Townsfolk should have put me out to pasture long ago. T-Bone, there's no finer sheriff on the Mesa. Watching you help folks is what made me want to be a marshal. Now you flatter me, son. Listen, Bat and his gang are coming back. Now, I know I can't keep Miller Glen safe, but you can. Moo, why don't you stay on and replace me as sheriff? Me? Why not? We need you. You'd be making a big difference here.
I'll keep the money. You divvy up the rest. <laughs> this should fit me real good. Oh, you mean me? Hey, claws up. I get to keep them. Says who? It says me. You let go. Wait, I see the first you. Hey, watch it, man. Hush up, you dolts, and get ready. Midnight tonight, we're gonna tear Miller Glen to the ground. Hot diggity dog. Then everyone on Moo Mesa is gonna pay us money so we don't do the same to them. <laughs> you like it, boys? No, no I'll yeah, I'll love it, what, I should have won. <laughs> Fang you very much. <laughs> This is the best lunch you ever whipped up, sis. Delicious, utterly. Oh, well, we do have a special guest. Everything to your liking, Mo. Mmm, couldn't be better, Bessie. Yeah, Marsh. <laughs> We're just so happy you're here. Here's Liz Sutton to say welcome. Cream of the crop, Marshall, just for you. Oh, hold on, folks. I, I don't deserve all this. Well, sure you do, Moo. The whole town wants to make you feel right at home. Go look. Ooh-wee! Let him in! Everything looks right tasty! Like it says in the Code of the West, a bull ought to hang his hat where the fire's warm and the folks are friendly. Your hat's always welcome here. You know that, Moo. I'll train you to be deputies just like Sheriff T-Bone taught me. Does this mean you're staying? For the time being. Now that's how we're gonna tie up Fat Blastagun and his gang. You sure are good, Marshal. Okay, boys, you try it. Okay, Cyclone. <laughs> Don't go! <laughs> How's it going, Moo? Their hearts are in the right place. Y'all are gonna have to work hard. I got a hunch Bat'll be riding in tonight. The code says, a fox will keep raiding the hen house till the rooster's cockle doodle dood. What? what? Just where do you think you're going? The heck out of here. We're up against Marshal Moo Montana. Nobody humiliates Bat Blast a gun and sees another morning. Moo Montana, your horns are mine. I can't believe that Sidewinder got away again. Ever since Moo left, the mass bull's been on a rampage. Yep. My, my, boys. I don't see any prisoners. Hey, any day now, Sheriff, we'll arrest that mass bully. 
Don't make me laugh, kid. Good day, Miss Lily. I'm sure enough having one. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes I just want to wash his mouth out with salt. Among other things. I just want to know when Moo's coming back. <laughs> Maybe never. My cousin Zack Rabbit is the telegraph operator down at the Miller Glen. He sent me a war. It's in here somewhere. Anywho, he says Moo's considering giving up his Marshal Star to be their new sheriff. No. Yep. He says Moo's even got himself two new deputies. No. Yep. He says Moo's old sweetheart Bess is treating him real fine. Maybe a wedding's in the offing. Marriage, that is. No. Yep. It's all right, Sheriff. Now, uh, who wants to read it? Me! Me! Aha! Get her, Sid. When Moo comes to save you, I'll have him just where I want him. Thank you very much. <laughs> we just heard. That plastic gun's got our sister. Afraid so, boys. He left this message. Montana, meet me for dinner and a dance. That's not what it says, Frank. It says... Montana's got hair in his nostril. Uh, I read it like this. Montana, meet me at Batwing Cave if you ever want to see Bessie again. Oh, yeah. Right, yeah, oh, that's what that's I said, right, you know. Too. Uh, I'll go. I'm still the law in this town. No, T-Bone. I'm going alone. I owe it to Bessie. But there's four of them. You'll be skinned like, you know, uh, a polecat or something. Utterly. Don't fret, boys. I'll be back by sunup. Bessie. Go back, Mo. It's a trap. you could join our little party, Montana. Let Bessie go. It's me you want. Yeah, I know. But this is so much fun. It says in the code, listen to an old bull and he'll learn you a new trick. Bodacious bovine! You're safe! Yeehaw! Oh, it's great well, to course. see you, sis. Yes, sister. You you silly. Nice work, son. But Bat and his gang aren't far behind. Tell everybody to lay low. There's gonna be a showdown. Okay, boys. This is between you and me. Say so long, Marshal.
Mighty nice of them to give us such a fine reception. It's not for us, kid. Look. How can we ever thank you? No need. It's my job. Does that mean you'll stay on as sheriff? Hey, don't answer yet, Moo. We need you, too. I mean, you can't throw ten years as marshal out the window. Big yep on that, Moo. Dakota, kid. So you all remembered. Well, yeah. And here's a letter from Mayor Baloney, down on his knees, begging for you to come back. Now, how'd you ever get him to write this? <laughs> Easy. Miss Lily swore she'd run for mayor if he didn't get you back. <laughs> Nothing like Miss Lily with a bee in her bonnet. Well, Moo, what are your plans now? As inviting as you all make it, I got to turn down the offer. Sure there's nothing I can say to change your mind, son? T-Bone, I owe you a heap, but I've been on the trail too long to settle down. Bessie, I'll always have a special place in my heart for you. You know I do, too. I'm gonna miss you. I wish you all the best. <sighs> well, okay, Moo. We're still gonna need a sheriff. I'd say you got a good start right here with Frank and Beans. Oh, shucks. On our way. Let's rodeo. <laughs> Boys, it's good to be home. the Wild West Cowboys of Moo Mesa. We're the Cowboys of Moo Mesa. We uphold the code of the West. Since the comet done come down, and raise Moo Mesa from the ground. We walk, walk talk, and ride like all the rest. They're the hottest heroes on Moose. And only random house home videos got him. Marshall Moo Montana, the bravest bovine on the Mesa. You're all under arrest. Dakota Dude, a soft spoken deputy with the strength of a stampede. And of course, the Colorado Kid. Always looking for adventure. How about this? You're under arrest by the Colorado Kid, deputy to be. And how about this? We got you covered. But sometimes finding trouble. Can we play a different game? This powerful posse is always on the move. Protecting the good folks of Moo Mesa from the Wild West bullies. Like crooked mayor Bull Ah, oh, there's nothing I like better than ill-gotten gains. Except uh, even more ill-gotten gains. Low-down scoundrel Sheriff Terrible. Gotta hand it to Mayor Baloney with tax laws like this. Who needs stealing? And the most mysterious villain on the Mesa I got me a marshal to fry. <laughs> the Masked Bull. Wherever these cowboys go, there's always plenty of action and adventure. Hey, where's the brakes on this thing? Huh? Oh, don't get up. I'll find them. Mm. Mm.
There's roping, riding, and rescuing. Showing how the West was fun. There's a big celebration tonight. Big celebration tonight. A big celebration, and we're gonna do it right. In the maze of the bad dance and fire. Last so I'm all. Cause you won't wanna miss a minute of your favorite Move Mesa cow tunes. And look for the whole line of cowboys coloring books, activity books book and cassette packages, and more from Random House. Yep, the Mesa's an amazing place to graze. And you can visit anytime with the Wild West Cowboys of Moo Mesa videos. Available only from Random House Home Videos.